Hey, welcome back to Hostess Coach. We are making an easy Bernays, and I thought, shoot, let's just go live and make it to, uh, together. I've got half a stick of unsalted butter melted here in a micro microwave safe dish because we're going to do this in the microwave. And to this, I'm going to whip in two egg yolks that I have whipped a little bit. But let's get these mixed in. Mix in a couple of egg yolks. It's going to help us thicken up our Bernays. Bernays is basically like dressed up hollandaise. Um, this is what I'm going to do here. So then to this, I'm going to add um, one tablespoon of white wine vinegar. I saw this. I'm making uh, fillets, so I thought, well, let's try this. So let's do one tablespoon white wine vinegar going in. And then we've got um, a teaspoon of lemon juice. Just going to eyeball that. So lemon juice, try not to get the seeds in. <laughs> a little squeeze of lemon juice. Um, it, the recipe called for one teaspoon of chopped onion, but I'm not going to cut into a shallot for one teaspoon. So I'm going to do a heaping quarter teaspoon or so of just ground onion. If you have flakes, whatever you have should probably be okay. Of course, this is not for, for company. I'm just making this for us. Um, a pinch of dry mustard. My hands are wet, so I'm just going to do a pinch with, with the spoon here. Pinch of dry mustard and a pinch of cayenne. Do a pinch. Pinch of cayenne. And then to this, I'm going to do um, a teaspoon of dried tarragon. Because that's really what the flavor of, Ber of Bernays really comes from the, from the tarragon. And of course, dried spices, I'm going to crush them a little bit to bring out their flavor. And then I have um, just a little bit of salt. I'm going to put a little twist of salt in, a little twist of salt. And I have two tablespoons in here of cream. I'm actually using milk because I didn't have cream. And I still want to try this recipe. So let me whip that in. And it called for a little bit of parsley, but I don't have any. And I also don't have any dried. So I'm just going to put a pinch of Italian seasoning in, just because it's green, and just a pinch, just for a little more green to go with the, with the, with the, ter with the tarragon, because I don't really want the oregano taste. That's really what Italian seasoning is. And that is it. So we're going to put this back in the microwave for 30 seconds. Let me throw this in here. How do you like the new angle? To today because I'm using the, the microwave. By the way, happy Valentine's Day to everyone. Um, I'm going to be making fillets. I'm just going to grill those in a cast iron pan. I'm making scalloped potatoes and we are having asparagus. And then in a minute here, I'm going to go live. We're going to make chocolate soufflés too. So that's coming up. But I just thought let's give this um, Bernays sauce a quick, just try it out and see. And so here we are. <laughs> What do you think coming along with me while we try this recipe? So we will get this out and give it a stir. Oh, it's already starting to thicken up. So we want to take it out and whip it every 30, 20 to 30 se uh, seconds because we don't want our egg yolks to curdle in here. That would be a bummer. So we're going to give that a little whip just so our egg yolks don't get cooked like scrambled eggs in our sauce and then let that go another 30 seconds and then boom we should have Bernays sauce so as easy as that less than five minutes uh, on testing out a quick sauce so one of the fun things about a steakhouse is all the yummy sauces you can get the peppercorn or the Bernays which is always my favorite and I've never made it so now we have here we go quick and easy microwave Bernays. I know I've seen those recipes online, the quick and easy blender holidays too. Um, but today, Bernays in the microwave. Okay. And this will going to give it an another stir. Oh, it's starting to thicken up ni uh, nicely. You can smell that tarragon. Oh my gosh. I think we need one more round of cooking it 
so you can see, and it is getting all nice and thickened up there. So let me give it a quick taste for salt and just see. Oh my gosh, delicious, because I love tarragon and that is just delicious and easy. So you too can make a quick and easy sauce ready to go for your uh, Valentine's Day or any day that you want to have a quick fancy sauce to go on your steaks. Here you go. Easy Bernays sauce. Thanks for watching.